Hello there, I am John Quillmore, the Legends of the Mix of the Keepers and Dis, which in the last part we got here to Animal Village. We talked to bunnies and bears and whatnot, and it was pretty fun. We also uh, went exploring, we got a couple of sea shells, we got some heart pieces and stuff, and it was a fun time. So in this part we're going to take on a car dungeon, I think. We'll get to it. But if you guys can subscribe, that'd be great, but only if you guys want to. Okay, so we're going to actually take the teleporter and go to... Uh, Yuki Yuki Village, I guess. Um, and we're not gonna stay around Animal Village, which, well, here, as you can see, what we have for the teleport. I could, I could use space to go like faster, but I already got there. I'm already there. Let's work this place now. So, we want to use the Pegasus Boost on this tree because it's like, it's usually so since it's uh, run off. Yeah, secret trees are awesome. Nice. How awesome is that? Okay, so now we're gonna go back to the village, I guess. Oh, you know, I can find. I can go find Marin and you know continue on the story. But we're not gonna quite do that. We're gonna go like a side quest. So let's go back to the library right here. We've been here in a long time, actually. This is like the second and first part. <clears throat> so that book you can get before and now you can by using the Pegasus boots, so that's pretty cool. Nice. Check it, okay cool. The new power of color. Do you want to read this book? Yes. Uh, there's a new world of color under the grave stones. Five grains of sleep, boy, five, two, one. God, take note of that, I guess. Try it with all your might and you may open a new path. Are you worthy to receive the power of color? What's the world of color about? Maybe you should try it and see. Interesting, okay. Okay, let's try the Trinity game next. Get some magic powder, or more magic powder, I should say. Of course it's not there. I'm gonna try X and come back in real quick. I don't think that change it, but maybe. Maybe. I mean, I have like 35 magic powder. Yeah. I also have this toadstool too. Uh, maybe we can try going into the toadstool. I think it takes time. And uh, there's a way you can buy it, I think, the beginning of the dungeon, and uh, it's a ripoff because it's way overpriced, as far as I know. I'm a few spicy of this game. But, uh, I think I might just do that I'm good for you. Get some from the witch, I guess. So, uh, now let's go to the um, war panel next, then. It's always fun. Okay, we're gonna dump his shack next. Warp there. That's very cool. Okay, we could do dump his shack again, but is he still not there for me? Because if he's not there, that's a big bummer. Yeah. He's just not there for some reason. Let me just actually come back in real quick. I kinda exit too fast, so. But I think he's not in here still. I don't know why he's not in here. Did I mess with him up with the rhythm of the story or something? I forget. I just don't know. He's just not here. That's so weird. Maybe at the, I, I do have one Zelda amiibo, and that's uh, Link from Smash, uh, Smash Boy, I believe. And maybe she to activate, use some amiibo that make him appear. I don't know exactly for sure. But you want to come down here? Try to avoid this code, it's just, just, just mind your own business, I guess, the whole entry, as long as you walk away fast enough. But then they're just trying to. You. Okay, so that guy is. Yeah, so just draw these. Forget which one it was. Ah, oh, shoot. This is for the left one. Okay, I think it's. I lost track, honestly, but I think it's this one. Yeah, 
Come on, hit. What did you hit? Very nice. I, I messed it up because I didn't all defeat the defeat. Come on, it looks like Boo has been out of the way. Just have the one eye. There we go, that was the right one. That one dropped bombs, that's nice. Cool. Okay, so you want to push this one down, this one to the left, this one up, uh, this one to the right, and then this one up to the staircase, right? Cool, I got it, awesome. Nice. So with that, we are in the color dungeon now, awesome. Nice. Okay, for me, I have 35 magic powder uses, but you want to at least have 25 for this dungeon. I recommend you have 25 for this dungeon. So let's talk to these guys. Uh, this is the color dungeon with the color guard. You'll never, you'll need magic power to get anywhere. You'll need magic power to get anywhere in here. Say the word and I'll say you something. They'll, they block, they just walk out of the way and they'll block the Next room, door to the entrance, wherever. The next room. Awesome match. Uh, also, match power 20 uses for 100 rupees. You, need, you can get 10 uses for 10 rupees at the trendy games. This is just a bad deal. I don't recommend you really buy from them. And it's 100 rupees. That's pretty. It's overpriced, honestly. I don't need anything else. I have 35 pieces. Don't need any. Well, if you change your mind, I'll be here. Okay, cool. We have to say. Do you have any match power? If not, turn back now. Okay, cool. I don't have to turn back now because I have magic powder. Ooh, a piece of power, nice. Interesting. Yeah. Let's not deal with the pots, really. Hit that one once, hit this three times, and once again, uh, just stick over the corners and hit the corners. Then should be good. This should be the compass. There we go, nice. Cool. Yeah, nice. Okay, we can use the bombs now. Back to the shovel. Now there's a lot of rupees here, so let's just grab them all. Nice, 2044 rupees now, wow. Awesome sauce. Okay, let's go right. And then we have to take on this enemy right here. There we go, nice. There we go, awesome, okay. Get that. I'm gonna hit these things and put them uh, in the right hole that matches the color. Shoot, I'm messing this up. Kidding me? I'm really bad at this point. I'm really bad at this point. Man. Come on. There we go. Okay, with that, we can uh, get the stone beak here. Okay, nice. And a full heights. Be careful. Let's put the stone beak in here. Yeah, try. If you dare, make every, every tile square. Okay. Okay, so we want to go up here next. I have to use my fairy. I don't want to, but I have to, really.
Okay. That one hit that one hit that one. I messed that up. There we go. Somehow just follow what I did and you'll get it. Well, it's just trial and error, really. Get the small key at South Sour Stash. I think it says the same thing. Try if we dare make it a tower square. Okay, cool. We already, did that. we already did that. Okay, let's continue on. Yeah. Okay, so. Wait, open this one. I switched my magic powder, so it's ready. Okay. Ooh, I'm in a weakling. Your pitiful is no match for me. Try something else with this sword. Okay, I'll try that. Just use my magic powder. I might die here. Traces again. Wow, I barely beat that, and it took all my. I'm gonna have to take the card back. Very. Is any more magic powder? I'm gonna strike my shovel. Okay, there's that, I guess. Um, this one that way, this one that way, to the left again, and then up. Yeah, there we go. Cool. The nightmare key, awesome. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's continue on. Let's go back, back in. It's nothing big, but just backtracking. So this will go down, I guess, this time. This is the feel enemies room. Then you can progress. I get hard or something here. How much power? Cool. Anything else in here? I don't want really need a be Okay, whatever. Okay, we have to jump in a... Be this one, I guess. It's in the way. That's cool. This isn't a small key, so a small key, I should say. Yeah. here in this store another mini boss okay what a greedy fool you want more power a buffoon uh, like you you must be might as well give up and go home let me use my uh, bow and arrow now There we go, cool. Another fairy, awesome. Cool. Switch back to the shovel. 
Okay, we can use the one now. This not. If you hit this switch right here, we can open these two doors. I'm gonna go up here. Yeah. Heart, yeah, sucky, cool. Another heart, awesome. Now, is there like any arrows or anything in here? I'm kinda getting a little greedy here. <laughs> This should be the dungeon map, actually. Dungeon map. Nice. Let's take a look at it. So we're almost done with this dungeon, actually. If you think about it, it's just got like a, like a, it kind of looks like a t-shirt kind of thing, you know? The shape of the dungeon t-shirt, I don't know. Okay, I hate this room, honestly, because it's just a bunch of going. I shoot it. Are you kidding me? I hate this room. I hate this room. There we go. And the three hearts, so. Kidding me? Done to two hearts. Thank you. I only still got the small key. Now I have to do some backtracking. Please let me have some hearts in these pots. I don't even know. If they spawn hearts after I could body, you know, broke them. But we'll have to see. Nope, nothing, okay. This sucks. Guess we go over here next. Okay, so what you have to do is hit this one here and then this one here. I mean, I messed up on it. I'm gonna come back in and do that again. Okay, so you wanna hit this one at the top, this one at the left, this one bottom, this one to the right, I believe. Yeah, there we go, awesome. Let's talk to the last statue again. This is the same thing, probably. Uh, try if you dare make every task square. Okay, cool. Same thing. So I'm hoping there's hearts in this room. Oh, there's a heart right there. Nice. Some more hearts in here? I don't know. We'll have to see. Very nice. Okay. Okie dokie. Okay, so I'm gonna switch to my bow and arrow here. I didn't mean to do that. I wanna make my wide item. There we go, cool. Let's open this uh, door with our last small key. Look, there's the boss door right there. For the nightmare key. This switch with the HD burner, that's the easiest way I think you can you know, also do that. That's what you probably have to do. Um, let's go back to our shovel then. Yeah, okay. 
So this is going to be another boss, and it's the Hard Hit Beetle. So that's pretty cool. Looks like a switch, honestly. <laughs> but not a nice switch, it's like a terrible thing. I forget what did your dog, I'm sorry. So just jump and hit it, 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 just jump and hit it. There we go, that's all there is to it. Just jump and hit it like crazy and just go at it. Awesome sauce. There's that wood panel, awesome. I'm gonna actually use my fair bottle here. There we go, nice. Got a fairy. Okay, suspect a shovel, I guess. Yep, okay. We do have a fairy awesome, that's pretty cool. Okay, so let's talk to this fairy. Welcome, Link. I admire you from coming this far. I will give you the power of color. If you want offense, choose red. If you want defense, choose blue. Which power do you want? Let's show the sturdy blue male first. Are sure you want this blue male? Yes. As you wish to show up, please. Yes. Okay, I can say wait. <laughs> Relax and close your eyes. Yeah, you got the boom mail, uh, this, uh, uh, you take half as much damage. Okay, cool. I'm gonna take it, I wanna take you outside. So it's just pretty cool, you can, um, take half damage from these ghosts right here. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the boom mail. I, I prefer the red mail, obviously. That's what I'm gonna pick, obviously, so let's play. But, uh, take half as damage as you usually should. It's really actually, it's very convenient stuff, so, you know. So, that's good. Let's get the heart. The bomb. There we go, nice. So, uh, it's really convenient, I guess, if you are really good um, at Zelda games, and uh, you can just, you don't have to worry about, like, if you don't worry about, like, having a bunch of big offense and, like, hits and stuff for defeating enemies. It's very convenient, but I'm gonna choose the red mail because I like having double the power. Like have, instead of having eight, eight hits to defeat the ghost, this takes four hits, and you get a little, little hit back on the ghost too, which you'll see in a second. Um, but I'm gonna go, go choose the red. Mail. I actually beat this game the first time with using the uh, red tunic, whatever you call it, the red mail. Yeah. So the powerful red mail. Let's do that one. I sure you want this part red mail? Yes. The red mail. Okay. As you wish. Sure, it should be yes. Relax and close your eyes. And off screen, I'll go do Crazy Tracy's um, quest again and get the, you know, the medicine for uh, hearts and stuff. Yeah. So you get the your body is full of energy. Yeah. Cool. I want to take you outside. So it's just good cause you can knock it back. Enemy is pretty far. Look at that. And it only takes four hits. Let's see it so far. And my fourth hits right here, it beats it awesome. So that's why I, I beat the game using this red tunic at this point for the, for the rest of the game. And I loved it because I was able to just, I like having double the power. And, have, and taking half as much, uh, half the time of uh, defeating enemies. If that makes sense. Like it takes, instead of eight hits, again, single, these guys will take four hits to defeat, which is really nice. It gets them, you can send them back far away too, which is nice. I don't know if it's for all the enemies, I can't remember, but uh, so it can be one, two, three, and four. If I can hit it again. Is that for no way? Cheese. Final, I should say. There we go, nice. That's why I get the whippy. Okay, cool. That's really nice. I like having the tunic. It's really nice to have, honestly. I recommend it more than the blue tunic, to be honest. Or the blue mail. I would even want to call it the blue mail. So it's the proper name for it. So let's go back to the warp panel. Here it is, awesome, nice. That's one of the warp panels. Let's go back to uh, Yuki Yuki Prairie, whatever it's called. And I guess we we'll go find Marin in the next part, hopefully. Maybe we'll do that, maybe we won't, I don't know. So you can always go back to the core dungeon and switch cores anytime, which is pretty cool. I guess you're out there, you can just use the panel and uh, 
you know, get the different tunic if you want. Uh, I don't want to use the green tunic anymore. I'm really bad at Zelda games, so I want to have double the power as I said before. So yeah, this has been the my Dungeons of the Link's Waking for the entire Switch party. Next part will take on. I'll maybe find Marin, hopefully. You know, where did she go? I'll we'll have to find her. I'll get to her eventually, if not in the next part. That'd be awesome. So yeah, some Drago again. I'd rather think that you can give me goodbye, and I'll see you guys next part. I'll show you the links for the Nintendo Switch. Let's play.